The chairman of the Meghalaya Human Rights Commission or the MHRC, Justice D. Y. Pei, chaired the first hearing on the case pertaining to the killing of ex HNLC militant Cheristerfield Thank You on Friday in the capital city. The Meghalaya police had earlier filed an application requesting the commission to conduct the proceedings of the inquiry in camera, in private, excluding the family members of the victim. Justice Vaipay informed that the Meghalaya police request was granted and only the learned counsel for the family of the victim, police officials concerned and the officials of the commission will be allowed to participate or enter the courtroom of the MHRC. Today, the police filed an application requesting the commission to conduct the proceedings of the inquiry in camera, that is, private, in private, to the exclusion of members of the public, including the family of the victims. The request for the uh, in-camera proceeding is allowed with the right of that only the large counsel for the family of the victim will be allowed to participate in the proceeding. And no other person except officials of the commission, the police officials concerned, and counsel for the family of the victim and counsel and counsel for the commission. I cannot say there are many witnesses. We will try to have continuous sitting subject to the availability of the counsel. And you know the procedural or procedural wranglings are always there in the inquiry. It is virtually impossible to finish the inquiry so soon. It is not that I want to program the inquiry. I want to complete it as speedily as possible. Well. The state government is expected to produce the evidence on January 14 and 15. The judicial inquiry was constituted by the Meghalaya government last year following a breakdown in law and order in the capital city after Thank You was killed in an encounter by the police at its resident in Maulai Kantan Masar on August 13, 2021. The inquiry committee had sought for extension to which the government had granted a month's extension in November last year.